Folks, my next guests tonight are hosts of Viceland's first late night show. Please welcome Jesus and Mero. Thanks for coming on, but this is all this is old hat for you guys now. Yeah, it's kind of played out. Because you 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 had you had you started a podcast and that became a a late night show the late night on show. Viceland. How did you make that happen? How did you make the leap from podcast to late night show? Because I think it's what a lot of podcasters it's would like to do. Every, I feel like everyone that has a podcast eventually gets a late night yeah, show. Yeah, that's how it works, right? It's, really? That's the, that's the, they told you us guys have podcasts with late night shows? Right? No? Wow. Anybody have podcasts? You, you have a late night show soon, don't worry. Just no, keep when we started our podcast, we had no idea what we were doing. We actually None. used to uh, escape from our jobs at the time to run and record it yeah. in Manhattan. I'd come in like a suit and he'd like abandon school kids. Oh, yeah, get out of here. Oh. Forget your future, it's about yourself, our future. Get, get yourself home. I was a paraprofessional, which is like being a teacher, except way worse. Because, mm -hmm. yo, shout out to all my parents in the building, because you get disrespected constantly by children. They're like, yo, you're not a real teacher. You're you wear Timberlands. You're not, though. I'm not. I wasn't. It's not. But, it's, not it's not a real teacher, though. But it's a, you that's know what how it is? they could tell that you weren't a real teacher, because you were wearing Timberlands? Yeah, that's yeah. what it was. Now, you guys also... You you have a lot of well your nicknames Jesus and Mero your actual name is Daniel and you're why, Joel why are you so okay so I thought you for not saying Joel what everybody's like oh it's like Joel Joel I was like no that's Joel. only when I'm applying for credit cards and stuff like that that's yes. Joel. <laughs> yeah. but you also have other AKAs you for have, yourself other nicknames you have, you have for yourself something like seven minutes worth of AKAs yes. you can you podcast. give me a taste of what your yeah. AKAs sure. are each year? Uh, we got Jesus Nice AKA Jesus Vice AKA Pockets Too Fat Lacterio AKA Young Chipotle AKA Young Deiru AKA Pockets Oh uh, Young Randos and Nando Mil Nova Santo Vete Equato Young Day Party Young Hot Take uh, Mr. Nam Mr. La Marina and Mesh Marina with a cold Mr. Marina and fresh uh, demeanor. He has a lot. He has a way better memory than mine. Uh, I'll give you like four. Where am I? Camera two. It's your boy the Camaro AKA the Human Direct Flap AKA. Triz Khalifa. Triz Khalifa, a.k.a. the plantain supernova in the sky. <laughs> That's all you get. I don't think you can clear that, but yeah. Yeah. I'm not sure what you just said. <laughs> <laughs> what? Do, do, do I need one? Do I? Because I'm just Stephen Colbert. I don't we have one. We call you Young Steve Stephen Colcuts. Young Stephen Colcuts, a.k.a. Canadian Bacon. There you go. Young Stephen Colcuts, a.k.a. Canadian, Canadian Bacon. Bacon. Uh, it's hot. Canadian. It's hot. Right there. You know what I mean? Canadian because I'm so damn pale? Or yeah, why Canadian? Because I'm an American. I'm not Canadian No, at you're all. Canadian now. Like, we all want to claim Canada now. Okay, great. So, yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, speaking of wanting to claim Canada, Donald Trump, you, um, you do you guys talk... People talk about Trump in late night a lot. Do you guys talk about him? Do you deal not with so him much. at all? You know what? He sent us a nice bouquet of Trump steaks and yeah. some Russian vodka, so we've been laying off good. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. I might lay off if he did that yeah. for me. Yeah. The stakes yeah. are a little gamey, but the rupees. Cool. I would definitely have somebody taste it first and oh, send yeah. it to me. Yeah, yeah. Just microwave it. You know what I mean? Kill the germs. Now uh, it's on. It's on your season two now. What, yes. Is it in presently in season two? Presently okay, in season two. So when you went for season one to season two, did you have any demands? Anything you wanted? To have Absolutely. Oh, everything went up. The price went up. Yeah. Uh, we demand like lamb meat on set. Mm -hmm. Just the gyro meat. Gyro spinning in the thing. Yeah. <laughs> Extra tzatziki. tzatziki. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. You're very very hopeful that that's lamb. Uh, yeah. Listen. No, it's not. It's zero. I don't ask it's questions. Just, yeah. It's just brown it's, and salty. It, it tastes like meat, so, you know. <laughs> it's half the battle right there. No, I saw Kanye had the freezy, like, mixed drink thing that has, like, Hennessy and stuff. I was like, we need six of those. Wait, wait, Kanye had a... He had has a, a frozen Hennessy machine. He's yeah. backstage. A That's frozen Hennessy machine? Yeah. Frozen Hennessy. Frozen that Hennessy. will <laughs> you up, <laughs> I mean, you know, it's Kanye, you know. Frozen you know what I'm Hennessy. Frozen Hennessy. My man Steph Coldcuts knows is what it is. I've heard of Frosé, but that is... Oh, that's the next level right that there. That is ridiculous. Next, yeah. But your version of that is just meat. Yeah. Meat. Just meat. Just as, as much smoked meat as possible. Give wow. Me Do you like smoked meats? Oh, who doesn't? Do you smoke it yourself? Yeah. Uh, no, not that low. I smoke on the meat. Like... Do you guys talk about pot? Do you like... Did you guys meet Elizabeth Warren? Yeah. Uh, we, we did. Yeah. She legalized weed, right, in America? In... Is she pro... Part of is she oh, pro legalization? Okay. She's pro legalization. Wow. Yeah. No wonder the audience is clapping. Yeah, they love her. <laughs> also, the man back there got the weed face. He's like, I smoke hella weed, yeah. man. Now, I understand you guys got an announcement uh, to make tonight uh, for your fans. You've got a project coming That's up. That's right. Today. We have a book. Yes, a book coming out from Random House. A yes. real book, not like a book we sell in the trainer. No, no, you no. You go on Barnes & Noble, yeah. 
You go to Amazon.com and buy. Train? Yeah, right. Yes. You can buy books on the train. There's not so books as they're like five pages stapled together. Oh, sure, 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 sure. Those are real books on the cover or something like that. Yeah. It's a life advice book. Basically, us giving different. Viewpoints on things in life. He's life married advice. with four kids. Do you I... have any advice you could share with us right now? Um, um, I have four kids, so everybody else pull out. <laughs> Shout out to my kids. I love y'all. Love my kids, bruh. You know what's funny? My life advice is the same, so... That is, that's a great way to get out of everything. Hey. Hey. Like that. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> that's what we're going to say when the Secret children. Service comes. We'll be like, hey. hey. Hey, we're just playing, bro. All right. Well, listen, Jesus, Meryl, thank you so much for being here. Hey, appreciate you, man. Thank you. Young Cold Cuts in the building. Yeah, boy, Canadian bacon. Ah, Canadian bacon. Ah, 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 ah. Canadian bacon. Jesus <laughs> and Meryl, Eric.